you guessed it, we're in this position, the resting squat position because of the health benefits. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, so I'm talking like this so I can preserve my voice as well as I can. But welcome back to Tiny Tina's Wonderland's Coiled Captors launch trailer. That me looking off to the left is definitely reading the title. Now, I was waiting for a DLC because I'm pretty sure everybody who bought Tiny Tina's Wonderlands flew through the game already and it was just like, yeah, it's just like what it is. But I I'm I actually oh man, it's hard to say that like I'm enjoying the end game. It feels like the end game literally has nothing. But I definitely like I'm gonna run through the game again and make like make a new character or something like that. But I'm chaos level twenty, everything. I'm pretty that's not like even a big flex. Got a lot of um I got a lot of gear. I haven't found, actually, I guess that's the next thing, besides collecting all the lucky dice and everything like that, which I have most of, is getting like a piece of volatile gear or something like that, but other than that, I have everything else done, so it's like, yeah, I was waiting for this, I was like, I remember watching their, it was like a season pass video, right, or something like that, and they have a new class coming and everything, or was I wrong, I'm probably living in an alternate dimension where that's a real thing, let me see. Oh no, if I turn too much Tiny Tina's Wonderlands uh season pass Oh yeah, they had the season pass trailer. So that was revealed. New class, yeah, blah blah blah. So yeah. I'm gonna wait for that to come. Can't wait for that. But let's hop into this. The coil looked into the oh, welcome back ladies and gentlemen to another video sending out a lot of love subscribe if you want to be a founder I upload every single day or not. It's okay. Let's go eyes of a god and blinded him Believing that this act made them equals But there is no equality between the captives and their captives But one thing is certain, allowing a single being to live without freedom makes monsters of us all. For freedom is the only thing that can truly show you who you are. They got a new spell where you can actually roll a d20 now. Coil Captain. There it is, available now. The season pass, and okay, 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 okay. So that's the first release. So I remember seeing this in the in the um, season pass. What they should do, right? Actually, it looks cool. It's probably gonna be a way better breakdown trailer than I'm gonna do. This looks like like, okay. So you see the little like patterns on it? Doesn't that look like something out of SpongeBob? I like it. Free the Mad God. I like the little. I don't know if this, yeah, I don't know if, hmm, I'm trying to think about the hat that I've seen. New cosmetics and stuff. Yeah, the hair I think is new too. This is new. And then of course the face. I don't really use the face cosmetics that much. I had a couple on to like kind of match my like my Spore Warden Clawbringer, but my Spore Warden Clawbringer has now become a Spore Warden Stabomancer because I mean damage, right? Um, but oh, I love the scales on the armor. <laughs> that dance, bro. <laughs> it looks like a dance is something I've seen out of Gary's mod. Yeah, this tricorn right here. I don't know if this is actually in the game already, but it might be. But that's uh, one thing I was going to say about the armor that I really wish they did is allowed you or... Would that be hard to add a patch to the game that would allow you to change the gear, like the gear look? Because if like the character customization in this game is already pretty good, I, I wouldn't say it's the craziest thing. It's nice how free you can be with like enhancing the sliders. Like I have my character's voice all the way like, to, oh, which which uh, the clever voice for the guy all the way down, and it sounds absolutely hilarious, but. Aside from the sliders and all that, I feel like they should add a, add a option to change the look of the armor 
or like it, even a re-roll feature if they want to make it so like you, you would have to work some of the currency or maybe just make it gold give another use to gold to like um re-roll the looks of the armors like this armor looks sick but imagine if like they added it where you could put capes on the armor like they allowed you to actually customize the armor that is something that needs to come during the update of the game or during during the progression of the game that really needs to come that would make me that's one feature that i feel like every it, it would be like one of those like I don't know how you really describe a quality of life change. A quality of life would, to me, would make the game a bit like, a bit more smooth. So like when they fix the parts of the UI that I've heard people have been having trouble with, which I can't really see what people are talking about. I don't think I've had any problems with the UI in game, but maybe I have. There, there's probably a few things I found that were pretty annoying. So quality of life changes like that, but I feel like I could slap the customization into a quality of life change because that's what sucks is you have to get certain variations and stuff of the armor oh there's a backpack on this dude hmm. oh that wasn't a spell that was the t-door shotgun that came out as a d20 that's awesome but yeah um i think that'd be a quality of life change because you you get the armor you want like you get a good armor with a good roll but it's like not the armor that it's not the look of the armor that you want and i'm pretty sure everyone wants to rock a cape so i think like the best thing would just be to add the feature that you could put a cape on any armor i feel like being the hero in a game or just like even being a villain rocking a cape is just so badass and it sucks that you have to have like you have to get a certain variation of the armor and I don't know, is is it actually possible, I don't know if it is in this game, to get, like, is it random? Is it completely random? Like, you could get a perfect roll with the perfect armor look with everything. I, I don't know if that's possible or literally the look is locked to certain variations. Because if you get a certain look for a certain armor and it's like, like a cape can be on any of the armors, not just like, the ones that have Clawbringer or Berserker, because that's what I've noticed. It's like Berserker, Clawbringer, and I think sometimes Grave, is it Grave, Graveborn? I think those armors have capes. Also, these are three new armor sets right here, I think, because the backpack, this kind of looks similar to one that's already in there. See, like, add slap on a cape to those or slap on some sort of, like, short cape short cape that kind of hangs down the back oh there we go actually that is exactly what i'm talking about short capes like that or yeah but i think there needs to be more like a uh, customization definitely when it comes when it comes to the armor at least <laughs> that dance bro is something definitely out of gary's mod anyways i've definitely been having a lot of fun with the game i have gameplay on my second channel of just playing it and having a good time. I've been playing it on stream. It's it's really good. My stream, well, you guys don't need to know this, but the footage is kind of old because, yeah, like I said, I'm at Chaos 20 now and most of the things in the game are done. But, yeah, now this is available. Free an old god from his fleshy prison in the mirror of mystery. That's fun. New loot, locales, and challenges. Wait in coiled captors. All right, more stuff to do. Much love and moonlight, and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.